everyone and welcome back to Dee's Playroom. Thanks so much for stopping by today. Today we are continuing with more toy unboxing. We are doing a lot of mixed toy unboxings this week and you know what? If things go well, we just might continue this trend on through forever. <laughs> well, basically, uh, kind of make it a primary thing because you guys seem to really enjoy it. I enjoy it as well. And uh, let's see where it takes us from there. So first we're gonna start with, my goodness, what to start with. We have everything from a Care Bear Peel and Reveal, Squishful, LOL Surprise, uh, and Sanrio characters, and Bubbaloons. I even have a Baby Shark Big Show. Let's start with that. So this is Baby Shark's Big Show Mystery Fin Friend Set. Uh, apparently there are three surprises inside. And I don't know, we just kind of saw this, my husband and I, I believe at Walmart. And it was like, you know what, let's just grab it. It's pretty cute. So, I don't know, let's do that. And there's the tear strip. And we will see what we get inside. Now, I don't know much about the show. I think we're all familiar with that very viral going song. But, uh, so let's just see what's inside. I still think the characters are super, super cute, right? So, of course, we have a nice seashell little kind of uh, capsule here. So, what will our seashell reveal? Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let's see if I can figure out who this is. If they have, like, a little checklist for me. Uh, let's open this up. Do I not have scissors? Oh my goodness, I still have to get my scissors from my, my crocheting. For those of you who saw my last video, and I believe it was the last video, I mentioned I was trying to crochet. Now, I can crochet a basic square, so yay to me. It's something, right? It's something. But beyond that right now, no. And my regular little scissor is in that little section where I'm trying to uh, finish some squares. But anyways... It has not been going super, super well with anything beyond the square. <laughs> but look at this fellow. Look at this. This looks like a little goldfish. And it looks like we might have... Oh, yeah. Look. We have a cute little sticker. He is super happy. Or she. I actually don't know. Like I said, I'm not familiar with the show beyond just, you know, knowing it exists in the song. We also have this little, like... Uh, I don't know if this is supposed to be like an underwater, like... Um, kind of, you know, coral thing. I'm not sure. Let's see what this might tell us. No, it doesn't really give us a name or anything, does it? It just says collect them all. I believe it said there were about eight to collect, I believe. But uh, we got, uh, to show who we have, yeah. We have this little guy down here. But, I don't know who it is. Let me know if you know down in the comments below. I do love him. He's very cute. Look at his teeth and his big bugly bugly. <laughs> so it's either buggy and googly, so I ended up with bugly. But his bug <laughs> I'm gonna say it again, alright. Okay, that's a new word now, bugly. Anyways, his big old eyes. <laughs> very cute, very, very cute. And let's go now. To, let's go to our Care Bear Surprise Peel and Reveal uh, little figurine. So look at this. Saw this. Yes, at Walmart. My husband and I did pick up a few things. This is Series 1 of a Peel and Reveal figure. Um, new bears apparently are in there. So <laughs> we have, um, oh, look at this. 10, reveal 10 new friends. Best friend bear plus secret bear equals best secret bear. Do you see that? So I guess they're combining bears to create kind of like a new bear. That's interesting. Okay. Let's see. How do we open you? Not sure. Let's get our little cutter, little box cutter here. Okay. So I like the concept of peel and reveal. It's kind of nice to not have to use water in a reveal all the time. You know, something a little different. Oh, looks like we have a little pamphlet here. We have a little, oh, look, a little display stand. That's so cool. Okay, and here's the little bear that we have to reveal. And it looks like here with the yellow and the green, it is combining two bears together. I'm just trying to figure it out. And it looks like we have this one. I didn't mean to reveal it, but, uh, oh, I'm just going to put that to the side. If you did not catch on, 
do <laughs> who this is. We're just gonna pretend like I did not just do that. So peel and reveal. So literally just peel it. How do I start peeling it? Oh, it is, it's just coming off. Interesting, this is fun. This is satisfying too. Oh my goodness, so satisfying. You know when you uh, put on like a, uh, uh, a gel peel skincare mask and you let it dry because of course it's nice and damp when you apply it and then you go to peel it afterwards and it is so super satisfying to do that peel oh my goodness oh look at this face so cute oh okay let's keep going keep going and now the reveal and yes, my hands are a little bit beat up because as I always state, I play with my dog Cosmo and we get a little, we get a little feisty sometimes. <laughs> okay, so the reveal. Ta-da! Look at that! What about that yellow and blue blend? And look, we have a beaming, shiny trophy on the belly. So let's find out what combination of bears we have here. Okay, so we seem to have this combination here, and we have Fun Shine Bear and Champ Bear, and that makes this Champ Shine Bear. Oh my goodness, so Champ Shine Bear, hello, welcome. Very cute. Oh, and we have a little stand for our little Champ Shine Bear. Awesome, and we will take a final look at everything I am boxed or open today at the end of the video before we wrap everything up. So let's go next to, oh my gosh, there's so much. Okay, one of our Sanrio characters. I have two to open today. And I think, yes, okay. So here are the ones we have uh, six to collect that we can see and then two mystery ones. And so far I've opened, I think it was, this one, let me take a look, it's behind me somewhere. Yeah, this one and this one. So that means I have to get one of those or maybe a mystery, wouldn't that be fun? Let's see, who do we get in this box? Oh, Karomi, that is so cute. Oh, we have a card, we have a card. Look at that, oh wow. This looks awesome on the card. I can't wait to get it out of the package. I sometimes, sometimes, I <laughs> I seem to, that's what I'm trying to say, gravitate towards Karomi um, and likability just because, I don't know, there's something about the naughty and nice. I don't know what it is, but look at that. I love this little figuring the big bow on the back like look at all the detail we have bows in the front or at least a bow with some ribboning under even underneath here uh just a lot going on some sort of skirt we have a wand with a bow we have a cute almost like wizardy or witch hat um we have this beautiful pale kind of pink for ears and purple uh around the head and the top of the dress here and we have some sort of almost like jester style collar going on here as well. And then we also get, okay, like a Cinderella vibe. <laughs> Wish I picked this up a minute sooner. But yeah, look at that. So is it like a, oh, like a fairy godmother? I would have to say, because it obviously isn't the Cinderella kind of character looking thing, but look at this little pumpkin carriage. Oh my goodness, so cute. That's adorable. Okay, we'll put the card over with our little figurine. And let's open up the other one too. So that means, okay, so we can get either uh, Pom Pom Perrine, Cinema Roll, or, oh, the Twin Star, the other one. Oh my God, Kiki and Layla, is it? Or Lala? Oh my goodness. That would be Lala. So let's open this up and see who we have. Maybe, maybe a secret. I do have two more after this left for my set that I bought um, to unbox in a future video. So if you wanna see what that is, make sure you subscribe if you have yet to subscribe. <laughs> so you do not miss that. But in this box we have, oh, we do have her. That's great. 
Oh my goodness. So now that will go with my other ten star. So this is, I believe, Lala. I hope I'm right. If I'm wrong, I will put it on the screen when I edit. <laughs> I will reveal my mistakes and look at that. Oh, these are all kind of like fairy tale vibes. All of a sudden I'm getting that. I didn't get that from the other two I opened, but look at this is like a fairy castle and look at that. The colors are so pretty. And then here we have our girl. She has a beautiful crown, nice gradient hair into pink, yellow into pink. She also has a wand. And look at that, a little feather, maybe a little lucky feather. She is pretty. I love that. These are so well done. And these, uh, this set, I believe I got, if um, you want to check out my video with my Tamu haul, I will put the uh, link to that in the description box below. Um, I believe this set was around $22 Canadian at uh, the Tamu website. So very, very reasonable for a box of... Uh, Sanrio character blind boxes. So really, really cool. Uh, okay, let's open up our Clown Spy next. Clown Spy by Funko. These are interesting little spies that I guess are, yes, clowns. I've opened at least one of these before. They're very cute, very well done. Of course, Funko always does great quality. And here we go. Let's see, very colorful green, like a very bright yellow, kind of highlighter yellow bottom and a pink top. And we have, oh, <laughs> look at this guy. This is so cute. Actually, you know what? I know where my scissors. Found it. I forgot I rearranged the playroom a little bit this morning and where I kind of put some of my stuff was a little closer so I can actually grab it. So let's see our character. Look at this. This is very Looney Tune vibe. We have the eyeballs coming out of the binoculars. Obviously this is one of the clowns that is spying on somebody or something and very, very cute. Has a nice long dark trench coat and hat. Very mysterious. Love that. Very cute figurine. Nice hard plastic or rubber. I'm never sure I, if maybe it's kind of a rubber because it, it feels like it has some gift to it. I don't know. It's interesting, but it's still very, very solid is what I'm trying to say. Oh, and there it is right there. Oh, no, wait. No, that's our character, but that's not his. Yeah, that wasn't his pose, but this is. So this clown is a common. I believe I actually got this guy the the other time I opened one of these. So now I have this one. So there are two poses. So I guess you can get this clown or this clown. And then you can get them in their different poses. And there is actually a glow one too. Oh, look at this one. Bonus figure, one in 36. That's cool. Okay, and this is Agent 404. And the other guy you could have gotten a pose from is Big Top Bob. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> very, very cute. All right, on the display stand. And now we move on. Oh yeah, you do get the sticker too. Class by Decoder. The Decoder, I forgot to, yeah. The Decoder, what's that for again? Um, you do look through it. If you peel that sticker off, it of course has like a transparent thing. Oh yeah. There's like this comic on the back of this little checklist. And then if you peel this, um, let's see if I can quickly do this. Uh, anyways, it, yeah, it's a big old sticker. And then you look through the transparent red part through there onto this little section here and you'll be able to read the hidden message, which is fun. And now, we are going to go to our Squishville. We're kind of doing a little more of the uh, quicker openings first. And then we'll go into the more in-depth ones. <laughs> so here's a Squishville and look at the little capsule and the cute little almost like kitty. I guess a kitty cat. Yeah, totally kitty cat. And let's see which one we have. Oh, look at you. <laughs> so cute. And it's, uh, I did open one of these Squishvilles in my last video um, a couple days ago. So, 
I, and, and a subscriber was saying that they thought maybe the character was a unicorn because I wasn't sure. I think it was a pig that I said it was. Um, but because they had the little horn and totally that is a unicorn thing. Absolutely right. But I seem to see a lot of these unicorn horns put on uh, all sorts of things like human type dolls, baby dolls, plushes, all kinds of animals. It's like you can take any kind of anything <laughs> and put a unicorn horn on it these days because you know it's it's a big it's a big trend this unicorn trend with glitter and everything like that but look at this this looks to me if i take away the horn and kind of just look at the character looks maybe like a little bit of a koala bear what do you think but very speckly almost like leopard tie-dye kind of print pattern on it i love it very 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 cute and we have this nice ribbon with I'm not sure what this is. It almost looks like a upside down like ice cream cone, but I know it's not. Or maybe it's an upside down cotton candy cone. I don't know, but it's very, very cute. And they are, of course, as usual, super, super soft. Love that. Again, the tags make it hard for it to stand, but I will try my best to get you to stand. My chair is squeaking. <laughs> I'm like, what is that? If you hear that in the background, I do apologize. I don't know why. I raised it up kind of high, and all of a sudden, it's just gotten really, really squeaky because of that. Next, we have balloons. Balloons. And this is confetti party. This could be messy. Let me see here. I'm going to try to get um, a piece of paper towel. Because if there really is confetti in this balloon, because I know sometimes that uh, they do have these little pieces that come out as a surprise, um, we want to make sure we catch it all. Oh, look, yeah, it looks like there's a confetti balloon that it does. So basically, these little uh, characters have like a little balloon type uh, prop, I guess, that. Out, <laughs> that you can use when you and the doll is squeezable or figuring and you can get the doll to actually or sorry figuring to blow up this little balloon it's actually quite cute oh my gosh yes yeah, it's a good thing I put that down because look at I'm seeing a lot of confetti already okay so it shows you a little bit how to open this so I'm supposed to lift off the top. Tons of confetti is gonna come out. Oh no. And then our character comes up and then it has the accessories. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Bring on the confetti. Oh, it's not too bad. Oh, it's not. Okay, there's a string attached. So I guess we pull. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my God, that was so unexpected. I should have known. Okay, so the confetti was all up in here. And oh my gosh, that was that was fun. And then this was kind of <laughs> That's so fun. Oh my goodness. It was kind of like, you know, plugging it in and keeping it in place so that when you pulled it, it allowed the confetti to escape. And that is adorable. Wow. That was fun. Look how pretty the pink and the blue. All right, so we have a lot of confetti here. A lot of confetti. We're gonna dump out as much as we can. Very cute kind of cupcake capsule. Like, look at that. A lot of detail went into that. So this is a great place to store your bubbling character when you are not playing with it. Let's see if I can something like that. So I'll move you to the side. Confetti. Okay, so here we have our little bubble ounce. Now we have this blind bag. I'm gonna just move it over. Try to get the confetti off of it. So much beautiful confetti. And here's our little character, our little friend. And of course, it's all staticky and the confetti is going to stick. Going to stick, but I'm going to try to move this paper towel out of the way so we don't keep reapplying the beauty look at that look at that so pretty right but we don't want it to keep going back on everything because it's just gonna get out of control out of control and I always worry about my 
dog Cosmo getting this stuff because I swear he will he will eat it he's just that guy <laughs> okay so here we do have our little figurine and uh, there's some there's a little elastic here we're gonna release our figurine from this little stand and I'm not sure oh, the face is a little squished in that's okay um, I think it's like a it's a, like a little dog, don't you think? But one leg is pink and you can move it. You can move the arms as well. Okay, can you stand? Not sure. I don't think so, at least not right at the moment. Very cute though. Let's go look at this sheet here, see if we can find out some more information on our friend. Okay, on the back it shows you everything you need to do to get your character to blow the bubbles. Oh, here we are. So let's see who we have. We have, uh, these are always hard for me to find. Oh, yeah, here. Odie. That wasn't so bad. We have Odie. Apparently, Maya is a rare. And look at all the other cuties you can get. Very cute. So apparently, I guess Balloons is a show on Kittoons on YouTube. So if you're interested in checking that out, go for it. And let's see if I can remember how this is done from the last time I opened something like this. I'm gonna open our little blind bag. Okay, so we have different accessories. The other blind bag. We'll look at these accessories in just a moment here. Okay. That's it. So we have like um, some sort of cone thing. Like what they like to do is put like accessories in with your character that you can actually attach the inflated balloons to afterwards if you wanted to. Oh, looks like we can make a, like a little party. Does that go on the inside? I don't know. Interesting. So it's like a banner. Then we have this, which I guess we could put a balloon on top of that or a balloon on top of here. Not sure exactly what this is. There's also this. Oh no, the, this is what they you use, I think, to have them blow up the balloon. Interesting. And then here are some of the balloons, or all of the balloons, I guess. We will try one. I thought the confetti was going to. Oh, I bet you the confetti could. Okay, yeah. See, the balloons are. Oh no, there is confetti in one of them, or some of them. See, I thought confetti was going to, going to be in all of these, but what you can do is because they're sticky, is you blow them up or have your character blow them up, and then you roll it in the confetti that they had provided, and it of course creates a confetti balloon. But it looks like we have maybe some confetti also inside some of these balloons for sure. So we'll use one of the confetti ones. We'll use one of these longer ones because we have longer ones. Very colorful, very cute. Um, put the rest over inside the cupcake for now. And I think we just put our balloon here. It has a little rubber band around it so that when you pull it, oh no, I think it did the wrong way. Uh, okay, maybe this wasn't for it. Maybe it's the other one. Hang on. Okay. I think we put it, can you go inside? One second. Okay. And then we carefully squeeze our figurine and the air inside should, <laughs> see that? Go into the balloon. Oh, and it makes a squeaky sound for extra fun. <laughs> oh, that was sound. Look how cute that is. One more. Oh, I don't know why it squeaks so much. I apologize for that. That is loud, but here we are. We are done. We remove our confetti balloon so pretty what a cute toy come on okay you have to be careful with that because you could pop it but look at that and it's kind of obviously like the same kind of confetti that would have been outside of it and see the confetti that's on my fingers and hand are gonna be sticking to the outside of the balloon, as I mentioned, and then you can increase your confetti motif or design on your little balloon because she's sticky. 
How cute is that? And then, like I said, you can put it on different things. Like you can put a whole bunch of balloons on this thing and make some really fun party designs. Very, very, very cute. All oh, right, so much to do with this one. And it's a lot of fun. And again, you can pack it away in that little uh, cupcake container when you are done. So you have everything put together and don't lose everything or anything and uh, continue to play the next time. Okay, we have one more thing to go. Ta-da! Okay, we have a plastic ball here and we have a little place where you can stand and display your doll afterwards. And here are the goodies inside. Okay, <laughs> the bigger one will be, of course, our doll. Pretty certain of that. I'm not gonna look at anything else right now because I don't want it to give away who we have. Okay, our first accessory is this beautiful little hairband. Our next accessory is, of course, our little sippy bottle, which is popular with the yellow old dolls. Next one is the little shoes. Very cute. Look at these little guys. They're like little socks. Oh my goodness, precious. Precious. <laughs> okay, and then we have, what do we have? Oh, wow, sparkly. I don't know if this is, is this like a little bouquet? It looks like really sparkly purple broccoli <laughs> or cauliflower. <laughs> no, I don't believe that's what it is. <laughs> okay, and then we have the outfit. Look at that dress. Oh, that's totally gonna go with those shoes beautifully. Okay, now it is time to see our doll. Who do we have? Oh my goodness, look at this. Very different. I was expecting the two balls on uh, one on, on either side, if I can speak. <laughs> but no, we have instead this big one that has a little tear strip on it too, just like the one we just did to reveal this cutie. Um, wow, okay, well let's do that. Let's do the reveal. Wow, look at how sparkly this one. Oh, maybe you could put this, okay. So yeah, you can remove this and replace that with this little piece as her hair. Oh, that's so cute, that's smart. Or I guess you could put this one back in too, possibly. Let's see, let's see. Can I get you open? Come on. Come on, I just did my polish. Nail polish, that is. <laughs> I always ruin my nails. Okay. Oh, she's so shiny. And it is that scratchy kind, it's not coated. So it might get on your hands. I don't think it is yet though. Very nice. Okay, so uh, do we open? Yeah, we get to open it. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I don't know. Do we have to oh, take this out? I don't know how to do this. Let's see. Is there instructions now? I have to kind of look. Okay, it looks like you have to squeeze it. Squeeze it. Oh, there it is. Oh, and it has a couple blind bags inside. That's cute, so it's almost like a little LOL surprise doll or ball capsule inside with your doll. Oh, it's so sweet. And we have, okay, we have, oh, like a little trophy or statue. Very cute. What else do we have here? Oh, okay, we have like a little bouquet here. Oh, I love that. Very, very cute. All right, I'm gonna set everything up for our final look um, before we wrap up this video. I will dress our doll with everything that we got here today or whatever I can from that. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll wrap up this awesome unboxing. Hang tight, guys. And here we are, everyone. Everything we unboxed today in our lovely little unboxing video. We have our little baby shark character here, a little goldfish friend with his little cute, goofy smile and eyes. Then right next to him, we have our clown spy with the nose and the eyes coming right through the old binoculars. <laughs> very, very funny. 
And then we have our two little uh, Sanrio character figurines from the blind boxes from Temu. Very, very beautiful. I mean, gorgeous colors, loving the pastel, love the little um, like accessory that comes with them. We have, uh, I believe, Lala from Twin Stars, and then we have uh, Karomi, and just absolutely great. I do think this is like a fairy godmother kind of theme, and not sure which this one is supposed to be, if anything, but that's definitely the vibe, of course, because of the pumpkin carriage here that I get from Karomi. And then we have up here our LOL uh, mini surprise, I believe, doll. And look at how sparkly she is. She is gorgeous. And again, you can interchange the top of her hair with that little hair piece that came with her. Or you can put the little surprise opening capsule ball back on for a big hairdo night or day. <laughs> She's holding her bouquet of flowers and her little sippy cup. And if you do fill up the cup, like if you squeeze it in water and fill it up, you can get her to drink it and I believe she spits it up and then we have our Care Bear combination uh, little peel and reveal uh, figurine which is what was it champ shine bear or something like that and super super cute combining two of the Care Bears to make a new one love that then we have a little squishmallow in the back here which I think has a koala kind of vibe to it let me know what you think down in the comments below is it a koala or what do you see? And then our bubbaloons. Oh my goodness. When I was tidying everything up and getting it ready for our last little look here. Look at it. I put some balloons on things. I just realized as I was putting the little accessories uh, inside the big cupcake here that yeah, you can attach the obviously the banner and other things and put balloons on them and make like a really super big fun party type adventure for your little figuring. And isn't that amazing? It's super, super cute. And I do wonder if you can get replacement uh, little uh, balloons for these sets. I would think you would want to be able to. I'm hoping so. If you know, let me know down in the comments below. And to pick a favorite, oh goodness, I have to go with my, my little girl Karomi. She is super, super cute and I love this whole Cinderella vibe thing going on with the little hat and everything. Love it, love it, love it. But let me know what yours is down below, which is your favorite. And again, if you have not subscribed, please do. And until next time, guys, take care of yourselves and others. Keep playing. Wait for more of these fun unboxing videos. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Are you loving them? Do you want more? Let me know because this is our channel and we're going to do it our way. All right. Love you guys and have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye.